Jane, you are staying safe and warm inside your homes today. As the snow continues falling overnight, you could be inside for the next few days. WCI3, Sarah Lehman live in Champaign. Sarah Rhodes, right now, just not good to drive on. Not good at all. This is Neal Street here in Champaign, one of the main roads, and crews have been working super hard trying to clear it up. But as you can see, well, you can't. You can't see the road. Honestly, I don't even know where our parking lot ends and where Neal Street begins here. And that's one of the many reasons people stayed inside today. But there are still some dangers staying at home in this kind of weather. The snow kept piling up even as people around central Illinois were working to clear a path to their homes. That's why people and pets made their time outside quick or didn't go outside at all. Just staying inside, hunkered down due to the weather, um, possibly, possibly tomorrow, maybe Friday, not sure yet. Alyssa Purcell says she and her nine-year-old son are finding things to do. Just been doing like household chores, you know, cleaning, um, been reading books and watching some movies. Whereas like my son, he's been doing Legos and coloring and puzzles and <laughs> whatnot. So we got a lot of stuff to keep us busy for the next few days. But being snowed in at home isn't always fun and games. The American Red Cross says every year hundreds of people are hurt or killed in cold weather. It's not just from being out in the elements or getting into crashes. People can also put themselves in danger while cooped up in their house. Always good to, to layer up and, and just be prepared. There are several things they say you should keep an eye on, like if you're using a space heater, make sure it's not near any flammable materials or that it's left alone. If you're using a fireplace, those same rules apply. Plus, make sure there's plenty of ventilation to avoid carbon monoxide poisoning. They say to be prepared for anything. Purcell says she feels she is. But I also have tons of blankets um, to keep us warm, so that's one reason. But right now, we're pretty comfortable. We're doing okay. Now, of course, the snow has stopped falling for now, but Storm Team says that the snow will fall later into Thursday. And of course, as it falls, there is that possibility that we'll lose power as it gets heavy on power lines around central Illinois. The American Red Cross says to have your flashlights ready to go, extra batteries, and to have all your electronics charged just in case you do lose power in your home or apartment. Reporting live in Champaign, I'm Sarah Lehman, WCI3, your local news leader. You gotta think ahead, be prepared. All right, thank you so much.